Okay, what's up guys? This is going to probably be my second or third longest video on YouTube. Who knows? It might even be my longest video on YouTube. This video from Flight Reacts is 50 minutes long. So, if you want to take breaks in between and um, yeah, come back to it tomorrow. You know, go to sleep, wake up, watch about a few minutes of it, take a nap, uh, you know, do whatever you want to do and things. But anyways... This video from Flight Reacts is titled Flight Reacts Updated Sneaker Collection 2020 New Epic Insane Heat Beast Heat. I honestly I need to do an uh like one of those type of videos like showing off all the shoes I have because I have to say I have like a lot of shoes. And I know it'll probably be a long video too, so my maybe not as long, but yeah, I, I I'll try to make it long. But anyways. If you shoot your shot, you don't miss. Let me get a heat check, heat check. 50 minutes. I ain't think I had never reacted to this. gonna definitely be the uh, longest video I think I've ever reacted to. Nah, no, actually, I take that back. Here's another video. Hey, would it do flight crew? FTC. Flight team stand up. Hey, man, it is about time, man. Now, with all this, like, them shorts, them, on, them shorts is actually dope. I thought it was like, a, I thought, I don't know why. I thought he was like wearing like a jersey or something. I'm like, that's kind of a weird way of wearing a jersey. But no, they're shorts. That's actually pretty dope. The last year collection I did was almost a year and a half ago. You know what I'm saying? I was trying to have all the links to my past year collection. You know what I'm saying? Viz down below in the description. But for now, man, we have all updated stickers. It's so fresh. It's so clean, clean. Kiss your boy, Duck React has cop over the past Dang. year now you guys if you uh seen earlier on and everything man Dang. i have most of my new shoes on the left side the, the old easy shoes the right jordans side, just nikes over. and then we have all the rest of the shoes that don't have boxes that are along my stairway i'll just end up grabbing the camera vlog style and just record them you know what i'm saying so we don't make it too too long man but let's get started before i even get started Comment down below right now what shoes you got on your damn feet right now, man. What's the heat now, check? Now, um, right, some and Dick's going Sporting Goods socks, <laughs> if that counts. Out of my entire sneaker collection, man. Let's get on to it. Okay, starting off, man. Now, some of these uh, new ones do not. Oh, yeah. Those, those, those were the last pairs of shoes that I had bought before this whole quarantine situation. Actually, because, no, I got them right here. Those were the last pairs of shoes I had bought before this whole quarantine thing had happened. So I got them right here. I had I have to show them off. I think these are the ones. If not, these are probably just the uh, regular OG black infrared sixes. Yup, these are the OG ones. Dang, what did I do with those other ones? I hope I didn't like accidentally put them somewhere and just straight up forgot like where I put them and stuff. But dang, what did I do with them? Uh, they're all the way at the bottom. I'm like, I ain't trying to dig with through all of that and stuff to get them and things. I sure have don't know what I did with those shoes. I know I put them somewhere, but I don't know where. Dang, bruh. Man, that's messed up. I was really... Maybe it's this box right here. I'm thinking it might be this box. Let me move these shoes out the way. And then see which is... Yup, here we go. I found them. I found them. They just been misplaced. I didn't even realize I put them there. I honestly didn't. I ain't gonna do this with all the shoes that I, like that I see in this video. I just want to overall show off that I did pick these shoes up too. I know you guys is probably all like, dang bro, you can't just walk around dog because I got shoes all over the place. But anyways, um, yeah, here y'all go. I didn't even do like a video on these. I think I wore them like once outside and then that was it. But yeah, I'm probably gonna I'm gonna probably wear these shoes again. So uh yeah. I love I love um infrared or I, well not just infrared too. I just love six um Air Jordan sixes in general, but anyways, dang, I'm out of, I'm out of breath. Um, now, mind you, man, you know what I'm saying? I don't know the names of every single shoe. Yes, I am a little hype beast. I don't know the names of every single shoe, but I'll do my best to give a good description of what the shoe means to me. But, yeah, man, I looked at these shoes when I first seen them released, bro. And I just like the vibes of them. It just remind me of, like, yeah. Levi jeans. Levi jeans is still popular. And was I think they say it was, like, the whole story behind that was that they were supposed to be a Levi collaboration, but I think Levi dropped out. It was an instant cop for me. You know what I'm saying? Next, we don't have 
It was so fresh, so I don't even know what these acts are. These like royal, you know what I'm saying, 12, something like that. I want, released. yeah. Like probably. I want those in the, the food games. You know what I'm saying, somewhere in 2019. We got Chef Curry. Look at Curry, man. Come on, bro. Look at Curry, man. Bro, can't go I don't know. I haven't bought me a pair a of, of Curry shoes. I, I should. I don't even know where they, because they, they, they don't usually of, sell them at like Foot Locker or Champs or anything. So. You know what? I know the best way to clean your shoes. You didn't hear it from me. It's the best thing. You're welcome. All you gotta do is just throw these in the washing machine just by itself. Don't know what other clothes, nothing like oh, that. Really? So it doesn't get bleached through or have a chance uh, of getting the clothes coloring on them and everything. Put the regular soap amount you would put in there for a regular large amount. And you know what I'm saying? Don't put these in the dryer. Let them air dry themselves. Yeah. They look like damn You do. Candy. That's what I do with my shoes. Um, I'm just Regardless of what kind of shoes they are. You, man, it's, it's if I ever put my shoes in the washer, I'd do that. When you're playing ball, especially if you just have a certain angle foot. You know what I'm saying? Um, we got these fives. Uh, I remember copping these like uh, when I was on tour uh, last year in the beginning of 2019. Yeah, those shoes. I don't remember these. I should have like, bought have, them. You know, a couple. Of, you know, a lot of these sneakers I actually have pictures on Instagram. So if you see, you know, what I'm saying. Uh, I remember when they came out. The gram, fives, kids, I think those are. Yeah, they're fives. Whatever, you know. Um, I forgot what these uh, 11s are called. Uh, I remember Obviously, when those, like they came out before there, the Concords. You know uh, but yeah, this was a new, but I'm showing the pickups, the new pickups first, you know what I'm saying? Now, everything we're showing right now is going to, oh, I can't forget these. You know what I'm saying? I just joke. Gucci flops. Gucci flip. flops. Hey, man, come on. Man. I don't know, man. I don't know. Man. My last year collection, I should I can't, I, I flops, ain't, but I that's something I just wouldn't go as far as getting. I'm not uh, really into, white. like, the high-end designer shoes and stuff. My shoes, if they're, like, yeah, Nike, um, Adidas, Jordans, that's, that's really the only type of shoes I fool around with. But Gucci, Balenciaga, maybe Balenciaga, but if they come down on prices, like, about $1,000. Uh, we got the Nike Blazers, the Adidas. Um, I forgot what these are called. Um, these are Yeezys. You know what I'm saying? I've been copping a it's lot of Yeezys. Yeezy 700 um, or Boost like, 700, 700 Boost, however they call them. But it's right there on the box. Yeah, you can go hard in the paint. Next, you got, can't go wrong with the Gucci's, you know? No, I don't remember. Oh, yeah. These are the pair. This, this pair is low-key fire right here. Um, I remember Look, some right bands. before I went to Vegas for the second time. Uh, I've only been at Vegas like two times, so when I went the second time, I'm sure you look like just some like sure stylish. You know what I'm saying? I don't know, some just and so I ended up going with red and black shoes. vans. You know, I got a lot more different designer shoes too throughout 2019. Can't go wrong, designer shoes. One thing with designer shoes, man, like I feel like it makes you stick out. Like before. You know what I'm saying? When I got money and stuff, like, I was looking at designer shoes, like, people like, man, they just buying that for the hype and stuff. They just buying it to just, you know what I'm saying, follow a trend. But, nah, man, I feel like you really be sticking out. Like, if you go to a function or something like that, bro, it just, it just, you, got you just Valencia get a different type of, like, uh, category of woman, in my opinion. You know what I'm saying? That box, I was like, I always wondered, though. Um, I don't know if I got these new to last collection or not, but I just want to show them just in case. You know what I'm saying? These are the Balenciaga. Oh, always, so I, I never, it never dawned to me like how big the box was, but then I was like, you know what? Nah, because as big as those shoes were, yeah, those, I, it, I don't know. It ain't surprising that the box is big. What is surprising though, because I, when I picked up those, uh, I don't even think I uploaded a video on those shoes. I'm so behind on them shoes, but I picked up the Nike Adapt um bb 2.0s and stuff and i've been like i think i recorded videos but i ended up deleting them because i didn't like how i reviewed them and stuff so yeah i need to i need to get back into the reviewing stuff i don't know i don't know but anyways y'all probably seen these before got the white cement threes you know what i'm okay, saying trying okay. to you know go go speed up so it'll make the thing too long i got the red you know, ones white cement threes, the red ones i do like the red ones head gotta have some you know what i'm saying retro threes in their collection um the white cement threes i had a funny fact story and i don't think this, i think it's my first time admitting this too I, it was hard for me to just admit it but it was just like fuck it i remember um 11th grade when i got my hands on some first pairs of retro since i was like fucking you know a little toddler you know everybody gets like their little like nice toddler edition shoes but long story short i had a fake ass pair of white cement threes in 11th grade so if Dang. you knew me in 11th grade and i was wearing white cement threes they was a thousand percent fake and i'm here to tell you in a minute Dang. you know what i'm saying in 2020 man but hey man hey t tough times don't last one just to let you know we got some more uh fresh clean clean uh Designer kits. Uh, we got some Balenci's. I haven't even worn. That's them. actually. Are those are nice. One hundred percent. These are a very nice color. Irish yeah. Green, green, green. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I've been liking a lot of neon green a lot lately. Um, yeah. Neon. You look. You cannot go wrong with like. 
And then, like, let's say if it was, like, a little bit, like, more black to the shoe, you cannot go wrong with some neon green and black shoes. I'm saying. Um, the color neon green is kind of grown on me. I don't know if it's because yeah. I've been into the Like, if that upper green. part, if that part was black and then the so white part color, was green, like, bruh. You know, I like bruh. That, I like that color. You know what I'm saying? Um, I recently just um, broke these out from Deadstock. Uh, Those are Balenciaga. Black Balenciaga. It was a like some thing, bulletproof I sandals. These shoes on somebody, bro. Or no, it was on the internet actually. I seen them on the I don't know about those ones. And I was just like, bro, like. I mean, Balenciagas, like but still. Like, these were like some old head sneakers. Like, yeah. You wear them, you'll never catch me wearing these. You know what I'm saying? These shoes grew on me. I'm not going to lie. These shoes mm, I don't know. Me. You could definitely see me, um, you know what I'm saying, with a lot more. All the other shoes is okay. Those shoes I you skipped out on. The future, these were very nice. Um, they're very comfortable. You would think that they would uh, be a heavy sneaker, but it's actually not. Especially that, you know, the brand is very um, comfortable and everything. Um, next. I have Jesus, my those. first pairs of Dolce Gabbana's. Now I've heard about hmm. Dolce, you know what I'm saying, for a long time. They look like those Adidas shoes that so Pharrell I, came I, I out with. Fuji, you know what I'm saying, everybody. So like, I didn't know anything about, you know, Dolce this and that. But um, I'm happy I caught these shoes. It's very hard to match a certain colorways, you know what I'm saying. So you would think that okay, a yellow would match with something, but nah, there's like 15 different yellows, bro. All right. So moving on. Um. I think this is my first pair of Burberry sneakers, it is. I've had Burberry belts and I still do. Um, and I think I have a couple Burberry hats, but I've never owned a pair of Burberry sneakers, bro. Hmm. Um, these are very nice, you know what I'm saying? They look like the out or the shoes. They look like they're supposed to be some shoes inspired by Iggy Azalea's outfit in that uh, school music video she did a few years ago. Um, these are very comfortable. Um, the one thing I do not like about these uh, shoes though is that they are very tight up front, you know what I'm saying? So mm. if you have a certain foot angle, you know what I'm saying, your front feet can hurt, you know what I'm saying? Probably go up life. half a size. Uh, moving on. Got to do that. I had to go up a whole size with the uh, Yeezys 350s. In a collection. You either got to have the BC3s or the white cement 3s, you know what I'm saying? And yeah, I got both of them, you know? And I've obviously broken these out. I haven't hooped them or nothing. They look like they hip. Nah, they ain't like them hoop, you know what I'm saying? But BC3 is very nice. And I can't find a top box that just ran away from me or somebody huh. broke into the crib and ate it or something. I don't know. Um, but yeah, man, moving yeah, on. Yeah, security camera. Um, we got, you know what I'm saying, the most infamous, you know what I'm saying, Bread 11s. Now, you are officially not a sneakerhead at all if you do not have these in your collection. I don't care what nobody's. Like, he, you know what? No, because I, I got a problem. I still beef about those shoes till this day, and them shoes got released like what? four, three, four months ago, the reason I was up at the store trying to get those shoes, Nike didn't know how to release those shoes. They was like, look, it's either going to be first come, first serve, a raffle, or you j just show up and just just do something. But yeah, um, there actually is this store that I might go to because I seen them and I'm like, I might have to pick them up. I ain't going to say it because I'm like, nah, somebody, somebody might try to beat me to the punch and things. So yeah, there is a store that I know of. There's a plug. There's a plug. It ain't even a store. I'm just going to say there's a plug in um, in the United States that has these shoes, and I'm most likely going to get them. So says these shoes was, uh, you know, uh, like it's supposed to be expected, hyped up. I wasn't able to get a general release. I had to go on StockX, so that's why you see the green tag. Yeah, I like... Like, like StockX official and authentic. Like, I like this green tag. Like, I've worn when I first broke, I only wore it once, and it was a fit on the grand. Yeah, it's like he had to go to StockX. Tag, yeah, he didn't go to no store. Whatever, so, therefore, know, it's kinda, it's, if you got more than, um, if you got more than like 20, 30 pairs of shoes and then you are waiting to buy more and stuff, like you overall know you're going to buy more shoes and things, you got a bunch of Jordans, Adidas and all that, you a sneakerhead. You ain't no, no, it's like you ain't going to, like it doesn't make you any less of a sneakerhead because you don't have a particular shoe. Like, no. It's like, just wait until, yeah, if you want to go on StockX and do that, but I ain't going to give people my um my hard-earned money just so I can put a few more bucks in their pocket. So. Yeah, I just feel like, it makes I'm paying the like store pricing. Stock X, you know what I'm saying? Okay. Um, moving on. Um, I bought these shoes out the inspiration of Valentine's Day. Um, because I didn't know they came in that type of... That's actually of pretty... I like the... the, the yeah, the um, box. It's called the Chinese New Year 13s. This is a very interesting um, colorway. I got these like two weeks after they released these. Yeah. Like, these were surprisingly not hyped up at all. You know no, they I'm wasn't. Really nah. Because they were colorway. sitting in the store you know when... Um, before you know, everything uh, got closed down. Very creative, very, you know Dang, he just mishandling. Just relax, bro. It's 
only right that I have to get the answer. You know what I'm saying? Allen Iverson, as you guys know, is my favorite uh, basketball player of all time. Second to Curry. You know what I'm saying? I was about saying? to say, I ain't so never seen that type of box before. But now, I honestly didn't even know anything about these shoes. Now, if you see something very, you know, interesting, they're two different colorways. Uh, I don't know anything about the shoe until I reacted to my dog Cash Nasty uh, vid where he was playing um, Tristan Jazz, uh, Stefania, and Brianna. Uh, and I seen, I think all of them was wearing these. You know what I'm saying? These are a very dope shoe. There's uh, those um, um, Air, um, no, what do they, they call them? The, 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 the Jordan you know 270s, those Jordan 270s that I reviewed uh, a while ago. Gone. That's what uh, that reminded me oh, of. Yeah. These are the uh, ones that just released uh, not too long ago. Uh, I got those too. Ones. I think they're pine green or Celtic green. I don't know. Um, I like your pine green 2.0s. That's what everybody's been calling them. I get my fit in the mail and everything. Um, ones, in my opinion, are very slept on. They've been releasing a lot more ones over the last oh, yeah. year. Uh, and I Especially mids. Doing that because that's a slow Nobody fools around with mids uh, for some on. reason. Next up, we got uh, another shoe that was released not too long ago. We got uh, the... I don't even remember what name but these fours. Like, but these fours are very nice. It's like what, what the fours or something um, like that. I think I posted up a flick on them on the gram. I only worn these one time. You know what I'm saying? And mind you guys, anytime like I wear my them shoes are slept on too. Kids, bro, I'm the best looking, you know what I'm saying, nigga, when I rock, rock any type of retros. You know what I'm saying? I take pride in I got those sure. winter eyes like, fours. I love those winter eyes fours. Them uh, fours is nice. Everything. You know what I'm saying? Using large vocab words. You know what I thought? You guys thought I didn't have. But hey, man, this is a new decade. This is bad. But check it out. Either going to be Concords uh, or the Tins. really shocked my eye, man, when I seen them. And I was really pissed. The C I it's going to probably be the Seattle Tins, maybe. Super Bowl weekend. We got the Super Bowl. Uh, oh, no, tins. never mind. Uh, this shoe is a oh, yeah, I've seen uh, those. Those are actually nice. Type of shoe. Uh, I don't know uh, how to explain it. Uh, it's like a mix off of Valentine's Day uh, slash, you know what I'm saying? Uh,. Edition. It's just it's it's, it's one of those things that just leave you all. <laughs> he's like, like it's like, huge compared to something nice else, but they um, they kind of reminded me of the Chinese New Year's ones he just showed, showed up. There's no way for me to get them. You know what I'm saying? Journalists. I don't even know if they was journalists. Regardless. Next up, got on some the bread list, fours. We got the bread fours. You know what I'm saying? You gotta have a pair of fours in your collection. I didn't uh, get those. I was Everything. like, nah. So I don't remember when after was like after uh, waking up early in the morning to go get the infrared sixes and things, I was like, nah, I'm not going to. Um, I ain't going. I ain't doing that anymore. Waking up early. I could have gotten them, but then I was like, yeah, I I learned the hard way when I got went to try to go get the bread 11s. No, you gotta reserve the shoes. You gotta do this with the shoes. You gotta do all these buy raffle tickets for the shoes. Like uh, last year, 2019 before. Bruh, I just wanna walk in and buy them. Something like that. All right, moving on, moving on. We have uh, another pair of tins. Uh, they've been releasing a lot of different colorways in the tins, you know what I'm saying, recently. We have when did the, they uh, release I those? The colorway for these. Uh, I'm just saying the Knicks colorway tents or something like I'm that. I'm saying because those are those are, are nice. Those uh, you are guys nice. Probably seen a pic and everything on the gram. Like I said, if you. It was like a lot of them though were like that. Have, upper part was white, so that's why I wasn't really fooling uh, you know with them because I'm same like, no, nah, I want like a darker like, colored shoe. You know what I'm saying? Moving on, moving on, moving on. Um, this is another pair of tents too. They uh, recently came out. Yeah, I think those are called the Celtic tents or just pine green tents. I don't even. Remember. I keep thinking pine green for everything. No, it's the Seattle, the, the nice. Sonics. Tens are dope. You know what I'm saying? I had because you no, because it's the um even the yellow at the bottom. They're supposed to be like a Seattle themed shoe and things. Because not too long before that, they had came out with some other like Seattle theme. I think it was like yeah, the Air Max two uh, seventies and so. Yeah, those are supposed to be like the supersonic themed shoes. They even say at the bottom and stuff where it's uh like um uh like supersonics. Or actually no, it's like I think actually no, wait a second. I think it is um supposed to be like I think they're I don't know. I haven't seen those shoes in a while. I need to uh bring them out and look at the bottom. But I think they do have like some Seattle stuff at the bottom. With these tens on the gram, you know what I'm saying? It's just if fact, not, then I think it's like the year's uh, Jordan champions 1 championships. Not even just two, but just, you know what I'm saying, uh, social media in general, bro. You know, it's just drip with the sauce, you know? If you want to join the, uh, the, the the movement, you know what I'm saying, you just got to talk to me nicely. It's an SBs. But check me out, man. Um, we have a pair of Nike SBs. Now, a lot of people are going to be like, Flight, you don't skateboard, you don't do this. I know, I know I don't. You know what I'm saying? But check me out, bro. I'm going to give credit to where it's motherfucking due. You want to know a fun fact also, too? I actually had one pair of Nike SBs. It was like orange, gray, and um, white. Uh, it was back in sixth grade. It was actually mm. a gift. You know what I'm saying? Those were my only pair of Nike SBs that I had. I wore them until they were talking in the front. 
Um, but you have the One Love SBs, bro. Tell me these aren't fucking sexy, bro. Look at this, bro. This is making me mm. want to make out with you, bro. These things is sexy, bro, from the detail to this little, you know, thing in the, the back and everything like that. Oh, this is cardboard paper. I'm about to say it. You know what I'm saying? Just gotta make sure. I don't know when I'm gonna undress these. It was originally I wanted to wear these for Valentine's Day, but they didn't come in time, so I ended up buying the Chinese 13s. You know what I'm saying? But um, just to warn you guys for the SBs, SBs run mad small, so get a size up. You know what I'm saying? Hmm. Um, moving on. Um, I wore these one time. I don't know. Oh yeah, I have those. These. I don't even know what these are called. I wore them once. The time. um, like the Yeez, they're like called like Yeez real uh, Yeezys, but they're supposed to be like the non. So they have a uh, reflective pair of um Yeezys, but they're like they're not really reflective. They glow in the dark, but those are supposed to be the ones that don't glow in the dark, but the same color and stuff. So that, and I think it's also supposed to be like the zebra print ones that they also came out with. So. Yes, yeah, so those was my first pair of Yeezys. Um, Flight might end up saying it once I pause the video, but I had to go up um, a whole size. You probably could go up half a size, but I went up a whole size just to be safe. But nothing too crazy to me, you know? Um, but yeah, man, uh, moving on. We got, I don't even know what these are called, but. Oh, the 95s? Sometimes when I'm in a good mood, and I see a certain sneaker that I like, but I wasn't expecting to get it. I'll just copy I think those it are ninety fives. No, 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 no. Those are um, um, like, um like just Air Max ones, I think. No, never mind. Like, you know the ninety fives. Like, no, the ninety fives is like those uh, Black History Month ninety fives they came out with. Those are just like regular Air Max ones. Vibing shoes. These like the Warriors color. You know what I'm saying? I can make these pop out. Like I wanted to do too. That um, you could send me to Ross. Just send me to, you know what I'm saying, a thrift shop, and I'll make something pop. You know what I'm saying? I had to do that, you know what I'm saying, back in the day. But, you know what I'm saying? Don't don't, don't have to feel like you need to get J's and Nikes. You know what I'm saying? To just, like, make sure you fit in and make sure you call yourself drip. You know what I'm saying? It's not about just getting J's or designer shoes. It's how you rock it and how you wear it. Moving on. Um, I don't know what these Those... are exactly called, but these look like the Charlotte 13s. Um, People slept on those. Instagram photo too. Um, I think they still though, sitting you know, in store. Wisely. Hard to get. Uh, moving on. Now you're probably gonna see like two or three more pairs of forces in the video. And but if they black, you know what I'm saying? Look, bro. Especially he got some black, black forces, forces bro, bro. You don't need to learn how to. You know what I'm okay. saying? Okay. Okay. Keep copying them, bro. And I don't know what's been going on over the last like couple of years or just year in general. Air Force is the white ones have been getting so hard to cop recently, bro. But check me out, I don't care. Cause every time I dirty up, I honestly wear the white forces like no more than three times. And by the third time when they're dirty, I just cop a new one. Anybody can relate to that. So if you have some white forces or right. you're just Air Force white owner, I, don't know, I'm not even I gotta wear the Air shoes Force until they owner. like, until pretty Air much Force what he owner, said, until right? the shoes is talking. Um, for you Air Force owners out there, um, how long does it take you gotta to interrogate them pair shoes? White Air Forces? Do you make them you wear them three times and then go, wear some other. Buy a new pair. You know what I'm saying? Whenever nah. you just feel like wear you, shoes um, until they done. Now, these shoes, I feel like, in my opinion, were so slept on. Um, and these were the ones huh. right here. You know? Um, those are I actually. I remember first, those. I sight and I fell in love with them. Um, I don't think they got slept on out in Seattle. I think them shoes sold out pretty fast out here. It's really easy to match. With Are those mids? Cause they I'm came in like the like, like OG like ones. Cause they look like they had the Jordan tag on the tongue. Go retro one. I don't know. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Hey, hey! That would have tumbled my entire studio collection. We can't do that. That was a W for catch. I know y'all seen that catch. You know what I'm saying? And I had the cameras on too. <laughs> um, last but I not swear, least man. is one of the last. Uh, the, I had one more shoe after this in my new uh, pair that I had cop. Um, so far, I don't know, like I said, I, I could probably have... Oh, these are shoes that he just that recently got? Me right here that I don't remember about, but, uh, for, for, I, from all I know, the best ability, I did to separate them. Um, these shoes recently released, and I don't know mm, oh, why yeah. the hell these were so hyped like this. Like, this is a nice-ass shoe, but, bro, like, yeah, I went to hell trying to get these, bro. Like, these, these people was acting like these are Space Jams. 
Like, bro, when I, I remember I when those came out. Shoes too, you know what I'm saying? Like, I expect like 200k plus likes photo on the gram. You know what I'm saying? That that photo gotta go viral. That photo gotta be like future TBHs and like this post and this and that or quote type. Because those are supposed to be like you know uh like, right here, bro. Like this shoe is kind of heat. Paying like, respect to uh like, uh, like Charlotte or something like that. Shoe, I don't know. Yes, bro. I ended up paying like something like four hundred dollars, bro. You know what yeah, I'm saying? Nope. Not that it was a lot of money nope. to me. You know what I'm saying? At the point I'm at now. You know, but it's just like principle. You know, I don't know what made the shoe so hype like that. I just feel like it's just, you know, maybe just because of the uh, the virus going on, kicking in and everything like that, or just... No, them shoes know. came out. Man. Well, I think they did come out during that time, but no, nah, uh, that, that's not the reason. Uh, new shoe that I had cop that's the last of my pair, uh, but if it's not, I'll always call it out in the video. Uh, these shoes are freaking sexy. Now, wow, these shoes that, grew uh, on me. I didn't Travis really know Scott about sixes. them too much, um, but I had to cop them as soon as I seen them because... I looked at my wardrobe, I'm like, bro, I got a lot of different That's colors up, that man. can match this stuff. We got I really do like those pieces, shoes. Bro. These is crap cocaine, bro. These is beautiful from the pocket that they got on the side right there, bro. You know what yeah. I'm saying? Like the, just the color. I don't know when I'm going to un-DS these. The only Travis got to say he can send me out any pair. I know because a lot of people like the ones. I got to get those sixes. I had to get those sixes one day. Technology or stuff like that, man. If I gotta now, save Travis and Scott's life and become his best friend. You guys are most likely, if you haven't been newly subscribed, have seen them before for the last collection. But hey, man, if you've seen any shoe up to this point, or even continuing that you like, or what is your favorite shoe that you've seen on me thus far, comment down below. Let's get it, man. All right, man, moving on. We got the, uh, the Yeezys. You know what I'm saying? These are the basic all black Yeezys. I can't um, do all black shoes. Special. That's why I was like, I didn't really like those Balenciagas he showed in the beginning of the video. Released, you know what I'm saying? Into the, you know, the world when they first debuted. Uh, moving on. Dang, what happened to the we box? The hair sevens. Uh, you can't go wrong with retro sevens, the hairs. Um, this is a little what bit, What happened you know what to I'm the saying? box? Big for me. This, I got like a half size too He big, straight snatched that box out of somebody's um, hand. He stole them shoes. LV, uh, <laughs> he straight stole those oh, shoes. So there we go. Um, I have honestly like worn these shoes like one time, everybody. I just honestly bought this because of the way the box looked and the way it was presented. But these are them some shoes you know, come off up and went like a bag. Oh, the summer uh, some slides. Gotta blow that dust off in that bit. You know what I'm saying? You got the, you know, the LV all red. You know what I'm saying? Um... Uh, slides. This is a top three shoe in my collection. We have the pants on 11s. Um, this shoe reminds me of Carmelo Anthony. Uh, I told you guys this from the past. Um, when I you got the box the upside day, down. I was watching it with my uncle. When he they, put me down they, it, the the shoes game, come like that? That's actually pretty dope. Team. You know what I'm saying? Carmelo Anthony he was like his second year playing. Um, I remember that he had something like this in his uh, shoe. Um, I don't remember if he, did, if he had actually, a brace nice. with this or it was his second uh, you know what I'm saying, or, or when he uh, did it, and then you know what I'm saying, you got the the, the, the reason why the shoe is popular. Eleven's is just Yeezy overall is like to me, insane, bro. probably you know the saying? best Jordans out there. They're, they're the most comfortable like Jordans that. to me. You know what I'm saying? I can and wear Elevens anywhere. Shoe. I've worn this shoe probably two times my entire you know what I'm saying like life, or since I got these shoes. I'm surprised that Jordan doesn't release you know what I'm saying something like this again. Or something more of a colorway of this particular. Like I've seen like on the gram, you know, different shoes that would have like um, customized retro leather. And it'll be like all purple or all yellow and stuff. They need to do them type of colors. It's nice. I like that material on here too. Uh, moving on, uh, we got the Wolf Grade Threes. You know what I'm saying? Nothing too special about the shoe. Mm. I think this released in like 2015. You know what I'm saying? Something like that. I remember hearing about solar, those shoes. Uh, uh, oh, those are retro, nice. Uh, what these is nine. Uh, I've worn these a couple times. Those are nice. Pretty good shoe, you know what I'm saying? Not too hard to match with. We got a shoe that's actually going to be re-releasing this year, if I'm not mistaken. Those like some, um, like, they, they don't make, space like, low-top nines. Jams, but they're damn near the same colorway, so they might as well just call it, you know what I'm saying, Space Jams again. But I fucked these up, you know what I'm saying? Or they just oh, yeah, look fucked up. Bottoms. Just long age and everything. Um, we got the Space Jam 11s. You know what I'm saying? Can't go wrong. That's actually dope five, how they come in the box. Uh, the one where Jordan retired. Uh, from basketball and I uh, uh, went to baseball. All right, man. So I don't know how these got here. I don't know what happened, but I think somebody, you know, what I'm saying, broke into my crib again when I was sleeping. Uh, and then, you know, they 
that just dropped off some LeBrons. These 12s right here, I don't know if these are new, new. Like I said, I, uh, I, the, the those, shoes I showed you first, first. No, actually, I don't, I don't think I have those new, ones. Do they got the yeah, gold tips? I'm trying to correct myself, but uh, we got these are not called the playoff 12s. These are just called, I don't even remember. They look like the ones the uh, with the gold tips, the reverse taxi uh, ones. Next up, we got the uh, Navy Royal 12s. We got the Travis Scott 4s. Uh, that was in a collection. Uh, I don't know. I I like those shoes, they but they wouldn't dope. be. I well, overall want the sixes now, or the ones. Guys, those would probably be the last of the uh, Travis Scott shoes I, I would I buy. A couple of years back, and I lost a wager, and I ended up having to burn these sexy. You know what I'm saying? Really, really thick babies right here. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, to like, burn really them. Thick. You know what I'm saying? I'm saying slim with the thick. You know what I'm saying? The cool gray yeah, 11s. Every senior collection gotta have these in their collection, man. We got cool gray 11s. Now you guys. He know, had to burn the. Burn oh, I wouldn't know. Nope. Cool gray's that I ever nope. had in my life. Uh, nope. Cool gray's that I had ended up burning. It's funny, in fact, I had those since like uh, the. I don't care what bet. I'm like, I'm not burning my shoes. Like that will not happen. During that time period, um, and everything. So like, it was funny. I ended up having to burn them, but I ended up copping these back. You know what nope. I'm saying? And you know, we just had to keep it like that. I it's wish like they would you re release them, you know what I'm saying? That's a, uh, I feel like they, that's it, a bold be move. A, a w. I can see Jordan Brand re releasing them though, you know what I'm saying, in the future. Moving on, we got the all black 12s. I mean, uh, ones, excuse me. I was about to say, Ned, how the hell you mistake 12s? I was about to say, I was like, those so don't look like 12s. They don't even the box that all, they come you know, in. Those are ones. One colorway, solid guy, you know what I'm saying? The uh, it's like the uh, uh, the, I don't know if it's called the Vince Carter pack or just the it's it's the Raptors Magic Seven pack. That's what it's called. It's the Raptors Magic Seven pack. I've worn these a couple times, you know. Um, I don't want to wear them too much because those two. Like I I out of all the sevens I think I've seen, I'd like the Toronto sevens. The Toronto sevens are probably the best sevens. Bro, he be straight up abusing them shoes. Watch, you don't get like a special video from his shoes. Yeah. Uh, you know, this reminds me of the Raptors. Uh, Vince Carter was in that dunk contest uh, back in the day. We got an uh, underrated shoe. Surprised I haven't worn this this often. Uh, we have the 15s. Uh, a lot of people make fun of these shoes. They say it mm. looks like jet skis, but most of the time they say that and they don't know how to dress. You know, so what's the like stopping I, limit? Because I, I, I hear uh, it's either 13 or 14. But I think it's anything after that. I think people just stop worrying about the Jordan shoes. I did pick up the 34s. I do like those. My collection. You know, I'm very mad that I are those that reflect the and the reason you know I'm no, saying, they ain't the reflective. So rare. I, think the I thought those were the reflective, uh, the you know reflective what pack, right the reflection here. of the uh, championship pack Jesus. that came out a while ago. As you guys can see, it's a, a two right there. Uh, these are definitely my top five favorite shoes in my collection. Very, very. Them look like them they fake um elevens that Cash had bought. I'm really trying to get my. He was like, he went to that so thrift store. You guys know anybody that has a a, a size ten and a half? You know what I'm saying? Any shoes that are mid top, bro. Tell them to holler at me. Tell them to give me a fair price. I'll show some love back or something, bro. But for my last um, knowledge, is that the mid top go for almost 30 to 40 racks, bro. Bro, I don't, bro. I ain't. I don't care if I become the richest, richest, richest man to ever walk the face of the earth, bro. I will never spend a fucking car on a pair of kicks, bro. You know what I'm saying? And yeah. anybody. That doesn't That's facts. agree with me, you're an idiot. You know what I'm saying? And it's that's just, facts. It's, just, it's, it's bad. It's bad cap. Really bad cap. That's, that's that's the best thing I can say. You know what I'm saying? You will never catch me spending that much on some kicks. That's ridiculous. You know what I'm saying? But check me out. Like them shoes. Yeah. Like nah, them shoes. Them shoes better like have a GPS system. They better walk for me if I'm thirsty. Like them shoes. They better have like a. Uh, Thing where you can store Red Bulls at the bottom and stuff, like, and then just like get a key, unlock it. Like, them shoes, you can't wear them shoes outside. You cannot wear $30,000 shoes outside. And it has to be like slippers for the house. Uh, we got the Yeezys. Uh, you guys seen these before. Nothing uh, too special. Yeah, the, uh, zebra. A lot of the, uh, zebra print. You know what I'm saying? We wore these uh, Yeezys before. On, I should on. wear my Yeezys here soon. We got the fives. And then we're gonna really start skimming it up now because I'm starting to remember a lot of these shoes you showed um, in the previous collection, or you know what I'm saying, and they're not new, you know. So we can just you know keep it, keep it pushing, you know what I'm saying, keep it rolling. 
You guys know how we coming? Uh, we got the the all the, that was nice. the cherry twelves. You know these were released in like 2015, 2016. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. I can't I can't do shoes with like um, a lot of white on them. We got the the sixes, low top sixes. But they came in one box. Look at um, the box. We got the the sixes, low top sixes. You know, really nothing too you know crazy going on. Um, do they come in that box or? Moving on. Uh, we got the they ain't supposed 11. to. These were released in like 2015. I'm gonna say no. You know what I'm saying? Maybe uh, they do come in that yellow. box. I don't know. Maybe that was the it's only George box that they can provide. Stop making those types of shoes that yellow. Everything. We got the fours. We got the. Uh, I don't remember what these. Oh, those are exactly nice. Called. The you gold know, on uh, it. I actually would wear those. Black, like I don't do so well with all black shoes. But if it got like a hint, like or like a somewhat a lot of another color on it, I would wear them. We got the metallic uh, fives. Uh, fun fact: these were actually my first retros that I had and owned as a teenager. Uh, you know, I told you guys I don't like to continue like saying it because I don't want people to have sympathy and all that stuff. But you know, I was not fortunate to have you know a lot of money and you know be you know in a rich uh, situation growing yeah. up and everything like that. So I didn't own my first pair of retros ever since I was like what three or four years old. We get them little tall. I like, I've never. I don't think I ever had a pair of retros when I was in school. I, like I, I was wearing pretty much any shoes that was under a hundred dollars. Any shoes that was over a hundred, couldn't get them. So overall, yeah, I, I didn't get my first pair of retro Jordans until I was like maybe a few years ago when I started getting in the shoes. So like his situation, um, you know, my family, they were able to provide. We had a house, food, all of that stuff, but. 200 on some J's and that wasn't in the picture. That's why when I started buying them, they were like looking at me like 200 for J's like what and so yeah, they um, yeah, it's uh, I can relate. I can relate Retro retros until I was in the, the end of 11th grade, you know, my homie actually gave these to me for like I was wearing forces converse and Yeah, that was you know about, what about what it at forces and converse and job, so, You know what I'm saying? It was a dope ass, you know, uh, gift uh, you guys seen these before, you know what I'm saying? Don't I was rocking much, dad you know, shoes uh, I think when I was in school. I remember I got me some Belugas, new Monarchy you know um, Nike. The reason why I keep taking the shoe out too, because you, you, you know there's going to be trolls out there that are going to be like, oh, he has fake shoes. Hey, that's why you're hiding me. You're not taking them out. Shut up. I'm trying to make, you know what I'm saying? I'm not trying well, to make they are in the 500 you know bucks. You know what I'm saying? But, um, Cause them are the 350s. I ain't saying they fake, but what's up with the box, bro? Um... In my opinion, um, when I first seen these, I thought they was cool, but over time, I feel like this was like a basic shoe. I feel like Jordan Brand could have did a lot better job. This isn't, I don't, you know, I haven't even worn it. These might turn into my hooping shoes. You never know. Um, I don't even remember what 11s were these called. Um, you what's know, wrong with the like bottom part? You know what I'm saying? Type time. Next up, we have a pair of eights that I've worn probably two times. Uh, these are called, I don't, I don't remember what these are called, these are, I'm going to say Syracuse, you know what I'm saying? It reminds me of Carmelo in the Syracuse college mm. days, you know what I'm saying? Um, I've worn this shoe, like I said, two times. Uh, this is a very nice shoe. Don't I need to give me a pair. Eights eight. look comfortable. You know what I'm saying? Eight, eights are a very And for those that own a pair of eights, how do they feel? Because they I look comfortable. I ones that I surprisingly haven't wore yet, you know what I'm saying? I remember getting these from like a... Um, one of those mom and pop low key shops that you'll find, you know, when you just cruise along one, you know, a typical day, you know what I'm saying, anywhere you at. Um, these are these are nice, you know what I'm saying? I haven't worn these yet, like I said. I do the box is dope. I like the box. Future. Next up, we got, I think these are called the Olive Green Nines. Um, mm. I don't, correct me if I'm wrong, like I said, I don't They're know like the name. They like that or gold. The they look gold uh, but, a little bit. Uh, I don't remember when these released. I remember copping him though in like 20 Oh, why is it? Though. He's, oh, he has been doing, I've been paying attention. He's been struggling putting the shoes back in the box. Like, he'll put it in one way, then he'll flip it. Like, bro, just oh, you know. put the, the shoe uh, in there. All white Yeezys. Uh, these were given to me as a gift. Uh, I don't remember what these are called. You know what I'm saying? Somebody uh, messing the boxes up. Next up, we have my first pair of off-whites that I copped when I first moved to LA uh, last year. Only I only got one I pair, and it's those uh, waffle ones white. with the spikes at the bottom. This is your first time buying some off whites. Do not cut this tag off. This is the no. official way to tell if they're off white or not. And plus, it just looks cool. You stick out more. You know what I'm saying? Also, it's oh, true. These are That's not true. called the gammas, I believe. They're just called the all black 11s. I actually like these. I, I actually would Very wear those. With this shoe. I um, like those. My favorite retros, if you guys haven't known. I don't, know I don't like all black shoes uh, too much, but I would wear those. Number one through, I think it goes. 
it 24 or 5? I don't know. Or maybe 23, because maybe that's why it's MJ23. I think these are called just the electric yellow foams. Something like that. Phone you know, posits. I haven't worn these in a long time. You can see all the I got the shattered backboards and then them lava you know, ones that they came out with. Your boy Dutt reacts to gentle washes. So fresh and so clean. Clean your hands after the video. I don't, I don't sure know about phones. If you ain't washed your hands in the last hour since you watched this video, bro, you a dirty person, bro. That's probably why you get sick off the Wash your damn hands. Yeah, I don't remember what these phones are called. You can, uh, let me know down below. Uh, don't remember. Uh, these are actually a nice shoe. Um, not that hard to match with them. Worn them about a couple times. Force came out. Um, these are dope, you know. Uh, nice navy blue color. Got the Yeezys. Ben had these, you know what I'm saying? Not too special. You've seen everybody with this shoe. You know what I'm saying? Next up, you got the Royal Fives. These are very dope. I remember I, I see my eyes for these on the first time and I fell in love with them. As you guys know, uh, blue is one of my favorite colors. You know what I'm saying? Look, he's with, struggling uh, with it again. He's just going with second and third. with the got shoes the in the box, bro. Ones. I don't know if that's really what they're called. They look like forces. Uh, you know, there's a dope. You guys see me wear these and they cut it out in music video. Uh, we got the Playoff 12s, you know? I'm surprised I haven't worn these that often. You know, or these are called the taxi 12s. I don't know. Yeah. This, isn't it a taxi 12s if it has that yellow stuff in the bottom? I don't know. Top five favorite shooting in collection. Concords. Can't go wrong with these. The Concord 11s. Funny thing is, is I think these are called a different shoe. You know what I'm saying? And not the Concords. You know what I'm saying? But I don't know why. Oh, whoa. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Go ahead and spam it up. Go ahead and spam it up. Corona reacts. Yes, yes, yes. Y'all are <laughs> going to say it anyway. You can't sneeze anymore nowadays. You know what I'm saying? That's I said, facts. I'm pump it like my man Curry. But look, all jokes aside, man, Contours, bro, you're not a real sneaker head if you don't have a pair of Contours in your collection. And this actual shoe right here, this is a new shoe in my collection because I did not show this uh, in my last one. Because remember, they were released in December. And my last collection was like November of 2018. These were released yeah, Concords. in December. So these are actually. I remember I regret buying them shoes right after I had um, uh, bought them. Well, like I said, but I ended up falling in love with them shoes. I was wearing them shoes almost every day. Like, 11s got, are my uh, favorite shoes. I don't know what these are called. I'm just called the Timberland Ones. Uh, this is a dope shoe right here. Uh, can't I'll, I'll wear them. At all. You know what I'm saying? Nice and, you know, uh, easy to match with, too. Olympic Fives, I think. You know, they got the gold pattern with them, so it makes sense. Oh, that's cool. The Olympic Fives. These are actually called the Syracuse. So it's something I didn't make up, I, uh, I believe. These were released in, like, 2010 and 11 or something. Mm. Maybe uh, sooner than that. I was about you know to say, I ain't seen them uh, shoes recently. Nice shoes. You know what I'm saying? I'm surprised I haven't worn it a lot more. Uh, 12s are nice shoes. Rec Show 4s in this bin. It's funny how they're called the Cavs 4s. But they're like a Knicks colorway. But it's funny because the Cavs... Nah, they kind of look like the Toronto or Raptors like uh, like 4s. Um, it's pretty dope. Like that's why, honestly, if somebody would have shown me those, I thought they were like some like Raptor 4s or you, something. I'm not a fan of them. I like the original Olympic 7s that was released in like I believe 2011, 2012-ish. Um, these don't, these are not it. I don't, I don't know. I just wasn't messing with the colorway. I like the original Olympics where they had the gold shoe tips. Well, these had the gold shoe tips too. Uh, but the other ones, you know, I just feel like they were. I don't know shoes. about them boxes, bro. Uh, like, cause that's a that's usually. Those boxes are like when you get some mid ones or some Jordan six rings or what are there or like one of the other pairs are like or the um because uh, it was those uh those Air Jordan two seventies that's when you usually get that particular box with the uh, gold Jordan on the top and things and then it has like gold Jordans around it and stuff but. I don't know. I'm like, man, it, you. I, I ain't saying his shoes is fake, but I'm saying they don't usually come in those boxes. I not that I know of. They might uh, have. I don't know, but infrareds or solar. Yeah, the infrared six is you know my favorite Jordan. But either way, my favorite Jordan. Can't go wrong with them. You guys see these plenty of times. A lot of people love, love them Jordans. Why is the box Everybody's messed up? Red thirteens, nothing special. Very general release. One of my, um, you know what I'm saying, Dang. more interesting shoes in the collection. I would have said that favorite, suitcase? but it's more interesting just because of the way the box is made and everything. Yeah. I take pride in looking at, you know, certain boxes and displays of the shoes. So, oh, wow. if you guys didn't know anything about me, my favorite movie of all time is He Got Game. If you don't know what He Got Game is... I, I think I heard of that movie. movie. I can understand if you were born in like 2010. If you were 2010, it's okay. That's yes, yeah, too. But if you're born in now, you don't know who He Got Game is, man. You just get canceled, okay? But anyway, man, these are from... It's like I heard of it, but I haven't watched it yet. Um, you know, Penny Hardaway. And I grew up watching a lot of scary movies, so hopefully you know that saying? counts. You got the Pearl Foams right here. These are probably my favorite foams, if anything, um, if I was to choose foam-wise. 
Um, I've slacked off on phones. I'm very disappointed in myself because I used to be a very huge phone fan, but I just slacked off on phones over the last like year. I don't know why. And then you got the Penny Hardaway. I'm surprised these. I can hoop in these high key. Another pair of phones. You know, can't go wrong with the phones. These are nice. You can't, you, you, bro. You tell me these aren't fly, bro. Like, come on, bro. Like, like, you got like a jeans, I said people sleep on white 15s. and black. Dang, bro. People sleep on 15s like a It's handling them shoes. Death stock. I have not worn these. I don't remember when these released. This was not from the CDP pack where it came with the uh, the bread 15s and the bread 11s. This is by itself. Um, I definitely need to wear these shoes, though. You know, because you can't go wrong with 15. You don't have to have J's. You don't have to have designer. You don't I bought me a pair of new balances. I ain't going to lie. You know what I'm saying? It's I just, I bought it just, you know, just for the hype. And... Can't go wrong a lot of people like are saying this, that. You know saying? I I tell you, I almost called them phones, but anyways, because he said phones a hundred times. But no, New Balances. So here's the thing, because uh, I know people are probably asked like, or like, how comfortable are they? They would remind me of like some uh, Ultra Boost or you know something like that. Like that's overall what that shoe is. It's like you know, it's the um, yeah, it's it's some ultra boost. It's just some like comfortable running shoes and things. New balances, there ain't nothing too special about them and stuff. Um, yeah, uh, but it, you know, hey, it's up to you. You want to go out, buy you a pair, um, try them on though, see how you like them and things. But yeah, if you if you're like a, a person that's like shoes with cushioning and comfort, then yeah, go out and get you a pair of New Balances. These are like the budget shoes, you know. You know, nowadays I'm more. I never had a pair of New Balances Thank growing up though. Yeah, I'm talking, I'm talking like I you. I'm talking to you. Like I said, I was wearing Black Forces and Converse and Vans. I'm talking to all you guys. That was about it. Like I said, any shoes under 100. I don't know. I, I don't remember seeing New Balances that much growing up. You know what I'm saying? Similar to what I was in a situation enabled not to do back in the day, bro. Go with the New Balances, bro. You can't go with New Balances, bro. 50 to $70, bro. Come on, bro. You throw on some nice Levi jeans or some, you know, nice Fashion Nova jeans with a nice nah. you know, polo on, bro. Bro, I'm trying to tell you, you probably don't Maybe black. pick over the nigga that's wearing some J's and a white tee. I'm gonna tell you that for sure, bro. You know what I'm saying? New Balances can't go wrong. Can't go wrong with the shoes. It's a black I jeans. These from the uh, last collection, I remember them. Uh, but a pair of Irish is always a must seeker. Um, oh, these are actually a newer top. Oh, I remember those. Top. You know what I'm saying? Um, this came out in 2019. Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. These came out in like 2019. This is definitely a newer top. Um, I skipped out on those shoes because I don't, I don't do so well uh, with all like white said, shoes. If I can remember the shoes that were newer in my collection, I would call it out. You know, but yeah. It's funny because I say that joke because I was speaking it into existence, bro. You know what I'm saying? That's the funny part. <laughs> Somebody, you know, like I said, they, well, those they, are actually kind of nice. On top, you know what I'm saying? Threw them, bro. Bring them out the box. I didn't have the cameras on at the time. But we have some undies LeBrons, you know what I'm saying? Hey, when I play the man Brody, I might be wearing these. Fuck it. You know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna cap. If he uh, plays against LeBron, LeBron I definitely will fly out to see that. I'm saying. I would have to fly out to wherever they're at, and I would have to see that. The Zoom 25 fives. I had them things back in seventh grade. Um, they were looking. I wore those shoes until it was talking in the uh, in the front. You know, fun fact. You know. Yeah, man. Moving on. Um, we got some all gold Air Force ones. Got to have some Air Force in your collection. Worn these a couple times. You know what I'm saying. Um, I was trying to look for some Air Forces before this quarantine stuff happened, but uh, we got the tens. You know what I'm saying? The Rios. They say it right here on the side, so it'll help me remember the name. Uh, nice those, those, those are fresh. Those are fresh. I like those. Next up, we got the Gatorade ones. I should have got the other ones. I think there was like purplish or something. I don't remember the colorway, but these Gatorade ones are nice. A uh, very slept on shoe, in my opinion. Uh, I like what it comes with, mm. too, and everything like that. I mean, oh, not. Like Gatorade rag. Oh, that's, 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 that's kind of so, dope. You know what I'm saying? I you know no I like I like Gatorade um, ones uh, those ones are Air nice. Are called, and somebody uh you know came like the Bumble. The they're like those Bumblebee Jordans that came out a while ago. The top box of this, um, but I call these a Steeler uh, uh retro um, not retros baby Air Force One. You know what I'm saying? But they came um, in like a retro one, one box. Moving on, we have the Fire Red Raging Bull 5s. You know what I'm saying? I forgot when they came out, but this is not the Raging Bull Pack 5s. Um, you know what I'm saying? Next up, we got the Laker uh, Retro 9s. Uh, pretty dope shoe. Worn this a couple times. You know what I'm saying? Let's speed it up. Let's speed it he up. Definitely, you know what I'm a he bit. definitely. That's why I'm like, nah, with them boxes, I'm like, he definitely had to come across some like, like plug, somebody. 
that was selling these shoes or they yeah they and they just couldn't find the og box for it but i'm like i don't know maybe if i seen like the tag part and stuff like on uh yeah if they had like this tag thing right here at the bottom of the or at the side of the shoe then i probably could have had a different outlook on it like you know i would have seen it for myself like oh they did come in that box but my camera back i don't know i'm seeing on two bars and the camera heating up but we don't finish with it you know what i'm saying uh next up we got the uh, i don't know what these are called these are nice air forces though you know the design yeah, and all that the inside you know, i do like it and everything these are called the easy foams you know what i'm saying i'm not mistaken uh i think i heard yeah time. i heard those Pretty nice uh phones up uh, another pair of yeezys you guys have seen these before in my last collection, all black pair, everybody has these, you know, nothing too special. They come looking like they've been wet or, you know, water and everything down. Um, I showed you guys uh, this uh, last collection, we have a pair of Balenci's, can't go wrong, pair of Balenci's. Can't go wrong with a pair I of Tim's, I found these um, on a special uh, day. It looked like them uh, uh, Balenciagas came in a Nike box, I was like, wait a minute, here. bro. Um, you guys have seen these, the last Those are nice, those the are Phoenix, nice. Uh, the Suns 8s. Uh, pretty Those are eight. Next up in the collection. Can't really um, tell. Still haven't worn these fives. I remember when I uh, went to ATL back in 2017, when I used to be in a uh, relationship and everything. I copped these. Uh, this is like my first shoe I copped when I had went. You know, what I'm saying to ATL during that time period uh, and everything. And nice. Still haven't nice. worn them yet. Moving on. A pair of retro twos. Nothing too special. Hey. You know what I'm saying? I used to scream like they ain't like some kids the making noises right upstairs. Can't go wrong with a pair of Legend Blues. Uh, Retro 11's up in this bit. You know what I'm saying? It's only a way to do it. Legend Blues. You guys have seen these before. I'm going to take them out. You know what I'm saying? Just in case for you. Like how I feel like, about hey, off-white shoes. Shoe, buddy. Yes. You know what I'm saying? You can see the two. Three, I, uh, the I don't know. I don't know how I feel about um, all-white shoes. All right. They get dirty so, too quick. Uh, yeah, man. Legend Blues. Uh, I feel like this is a slept on 11 pair, too. We got, you know what I'm saying, the all black sixes, uh, black and white. You know what I'm saying? Uh, this is a very mm. interesting shoe just because of the box design. I always like showing off the box design. These that are is like, nice. That, no, Chinese, that's nice. Like sixes, something like that. It's something with the anime. Like, I, I never like grew up watching anime. You know what I'm saying? So if you ask me anything with Naruto, but the only anime I know is Samurai Jack and a little bit of Dragon Ball Z. But other than that, wasn't big on anime like that. Um, but these are what they were designed, you know what I'm saying, and based out of. Um, these are a very actually nice. shoe. You know what I'm saying? You see all the artwork, you know what I'm saying, going on through that colorway. A pair of Red 11s. Uh, but these were released, I believe, in like 2013 or 2012. You know what I'm mm. saying? You can see that they're old. You know what I'm saying? You can see that they're run through and and and, and, and worn. The I don't remember what these are called. I'm gonna say the 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 Nuggets 11s. You know what I'm saying? The Home Nuggets 11. And then for the shoes that are in the boxes, last but not least, oh my gosh, bro! Holy shit! This those, is no, those ain't. To watch. Oh my oh, gosh! Oh yeah. These man, yes. I got another pair of Concords. Yeah. Uh, these were. I it looked like for a second that Jordan on it was blue, so that's why I was like, uh, I'm like, no, nah, I don't think those are Concords, but then I was like, yeah, but I'm like, them, them some old Concords. I seen the dude at Safeway, he was wearing him some Concords. Almost got ran down by this uh, um, old lady on the cart, but uh, yeah, the bottoms like they. There's actually some stuff that I seen where you can like clean that and give it like an icy look and when stuff. When they first so. released back in 2011, I think of uh, that year. Um, but I ended up getting them like I think in 2015, 2016 once I started getting money and stuff. Um, but they were obviously the older, you know what I'm saying, release. Yeah. It was very easy for Much them to get older. yellow. It was just complete Mine's yellow. haven't turned that you know yellow saying? yet, Definitely. but I think they, they had in there. You know what I'm saying? You know, I, I should. Why, why not? You struggling Where's with them the again. You know what I'm saying? Now everybody, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna take my camera vlog style and pretty much show you guys, you know what I'm saying, a first person uh. view the rest of my kicks that are not in the boxes. You know what I'm saying? Because it makes more sense and it speeds a lot more things up. All right, so you got another pair of Tims right God, here. Have you, you some know OG what I'm saying? Tims. Going down with the, uh, you know what I'm saying, sneaker collection. You got these 14s. You guys have seen these before. You can't go wrong with the Bordeaux Sevens. Bordeaux Sevens is definitely one of my favorite pairs in my collection. Uh, the simple fact of the history behind the shoe, you know, Jordan had his, one of his very most popular first commercials. Uh, and with the Michael Jackson, those are nice. Going those are nice. Uh, you have these. You see me hooping before and drop hella people off in these. You know, these are my undefeated shoes right here. I haven't lost. You go find me basketball game. I've lost. You know what I'm saying? In these kits before. Like, you got the right, uh, uh, July 4th. Uh, you know what I'm saying? 
I forgot what these are called. Got the, the Air Max 97s. You gotta have a pair of Force. Look, 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 man. Look. It ain't nothing wrong with having black Air Forces. It ain't nothing wrong. It ain't nothing wrong. Relax. Relax. Like I, God. All right. You, know I might, you I might on that activity? I can't even. I, you know I can't saying? even judge the man. Well, I got two pairs of black forces. Being. So um, one of the shoes that can't took me back him. to my childhood. Um, the reason why I had this in my collection still, and I plan on getting some more. Just never want to forget where you came from and stuff and everything. Felines are definitely a kick. You know what I'm saying? That you can have on a budget. Remember having these in fifth grade along with some shacks. You know what I'm saying? The felines are definitely the a legendary shoe. Um, you got the infamous. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I just call these a bone collector. I forgot. Uh, what, what are the retros of these? 18s or 19s? I don't know. Comment down. You got some want to talk about bone collector. On that. You've been seeing them. Uh, I actually believe this is a newer shoe in my collection. Um, I don't have the box of this. I lost it. Um, if you see it with one pair of shoes, this obviously means I, I brought one pair out from my closet uh, to speed things up and make better. Forces uh, clean. We got the forces. I showed you guys. I told you I got like three pairs of forces. These are my like just everyday shoes. I have a newer pair of forces that are dead stock. You know what I'm saying? Everybody got to have a pair that you got to wear every day. You know what I'm saying? Can't go wrong with the black, uh, white Oreo threes. You know, showed you guys these before. These are another pair of shoes that I knew in my collection. Uh, I don't have the box anymore because when I bought these, I bought these out the state. I never knew that those Balenciagas, those them sock like ones, red, came in different socks. colors. I, I always thought the they were just like that typical two, black and uh, white the other color. Ones you guys seen earlier, I had the navy blue and red ones, and I had the all Irish spring green ones, and we got these. Um, you got, I got these. Those are Ross, nice. Those uh, are the nice. Air Raids. Um, Yeezys, I showed course. you guys this from the last collection. Can't go wrong. Look at Curry, man. Hold on, man. Hold on, bro. Look at Curry, man. Inspirational right here, man. You know what I'm saying? I remember one time when I put these shoes on for the first time, bro. I crossed this <laughs> basketball player so bad, bro. You know what I'm saying? I just didn't have the cameras on during the time. But anyway, bro. I swear, um, man. We got uh, these shoes. In the he is a spitting uh, image uh, of that. Uh, uh, like when I was. Uh, uh, Lamel no, not ball. Lamel. The ball, the, the like, like ball the family, the father. Spitting you know, image. Little, little shoe. The younger ball, version. Uh, hooping on a budget type of gear. You know what I'm saying? Um. Got the Gucci's over here on the, in the cut. You know, you got scenes from the last collection. Can't go wrong with these. Retro 3's, you know what I'm saying? I believe these are newer in my collection as yeah, well. Yeah, them snake. In my last senior collection video. I got uh, those. These released in 2019. I didn't have no senior collection 2019. Uh, I wore these Dang, in the did they come out? video. You know what I'm saying? I had that fresh or clean, clean I polo I guess they fit. did come out you know last saying? year. I thought they got came the out the year before. You know what I'm saying? Got the ones going on. Got the Air Maxes. You got the flu games. You know what I'm saying? I got to get me a pair of flu games. All right, those, it's those shoes. Uh, Travis Scott sixes, um, maybe his ones, but I ain't too, like, I really want the sixes. Uh, what other shoes do I want? Um, yeah, but it, it's mainly the flu games and the Travis Scott sixes. I think once I get those, um, until I see something else, I know it ain't gonna be over with, but. Red twos, you got the NYC, uh, tens. You got the I don't have it. I don't. Which is a very I want to buy me a pair of twos. These are real leasing this year. If they're not correct me if I'm wrong. That's what I was like those uh, uh, 11s. I thought um, he was I pulling out that box. All exactly. You know what I'm saying? But these are the, uh, I don't remember what 11s. Let's just put it that way. Um, we got the uh, the threes, the beaters, uh, true blues. I don't know what the hell happened, bro. Oh, no. Some infrareds. Um, then we got, you know what I'm saying, going along. I think there's an infrareds, a solar. Yeah. I, I confuse these colorways and stitches because they got the same ones, but they're two different colors. You got the all. Yeah, they, all it, it did get a little right bit here. brighter. Uh, you got the Drake Champagnes, uh, sixes. Um, you know what I'm saying? This is the underrated shoe right here. You know what I'm saying? I don't know if this is real gold still to this day on this shoe, but it's a nice design. All right, got to get it tested out. You've seen those threes. Um, the Charlotte 10, you've seen the 10, you've seen that. Um, the nines, uh, playoff nines, I believe. Uh, I forgot what these are called. I don't know if they released in 2019 or not. Scuffed no, those up are 2018. On the side. You got the, uh, the, the shoes that get me the best luck in every IRL basketball game where people hate me wearing oh, them, and I will not stop wearing them. You know what I'm saying? I got those oh, bread Kyries. Really, you know I'm the saying, only Kyries I have. On the swag right here. Uh, Air Max already showed you the Carmines. You know, you can't go wrong with Carmine. Every sneaker collector got to have Carmines in their collection. You know what I'm saying? We're going to start skimming through a lot of shoes that I've showed you before. You know what I'm saying? Maroons. You know what I'm saying? These are interesting. I remember buying these in Seattle. These are only numbered. You know what I'm saying? I got like the, the number hey, they uh, selling 70, those? something like that of this shoe that only made like under a thousand. You know what I'm saying? This is, uh, by the way, real 14 karat gold on this tip of the shoe. You know what I'm saying? This shoe was made out of snakes, like anaconda. Yeah, to like, like that. You know what I'm saying? Maybe uh, the, you got the dog, prior before uh, I was uh, in the sneakers because I remember them shoes releasing out here. Which y'all prefer? All black Tims or uh, the wheat Tims? 
I think they're called the Wheat Tims. I don't know the North or the Classic Tims. Can't classic go off the Tims. High Top Air Forces. You know what I'm saying? I showed you guys these. Showed you, you guys like these Ned 11s. Um, I got Ned, um, Spizites. Um, Spizites, you know what I'm saying? Hypebeast Killer. Air Force activities already showed y'all. We got the Mike Vick 7s in this bit. You know what I'm saying? Um, we got the orange traffic cones. Uh, you know what I'm saying? We got the, Those are nice. the Miami Vice. You know what I'm saying? Harachis. I showed you guys these. Uh, we got the all navy blue Samoas. These are my go-to middle school shoes. You know what I'm saying? I almost um, bought them I shoes not too long ago. Because you know, I always like to cop certain pairs of shoes I remember growing up in. Actually, so no, it was a while ago. From, but these are definitely I haven't my seen them shoes, shoes in stores since. I had these on um, Reeboks and a pair of Shacks. You know that I wore all the time, every day. You know what I'm saying? And then, you know, last but not least, these are the Rostal Dashes. Uh, ones got from Ross. And then I, you know, these were general release. And that, my friend. It's gonna end this so fresh and so clean, clean Dang. sneaker collection, man. Hey, bro, if you guys enjoy, man, be sure to smack them a lot. Button. Those are a lot. a lot more difficult to do this one this time because usually you guys know I always have somebody recording with me um, or just somebody extra just recording so I get a better point of view. But because of this deadly virus, you know what I'm saying, going around. Um, it's like, flight. So take it serious. And just have Don't scare us like that. Take it serious, bro. My own safety, you know what I'm saying? But comment down below out of my entire steer collection. What was your favorite shoe? I'm going to tell you guys what my Them favorite sixes. shoe is right now. If you guessed the Them right Travis shoe, Scott sixes. Ball. My favorite shoe out of the entire collection is five, four, three, two, one. It's going to be the Concord. Yes, man. Concord 11 is my favorite shoe. Second behind the Pantone 11s. Uh, I I like Concords. They were my first my pair of 11s, but right now, if you're a steer collector, they ain't my you know favorite. Steer collector, uh, comment down below. What is your favorite shoe? Uh, going down in your collection, man. Be sure to smack that like button, man. On the road to three milli milli. Dang, he's that close. Oh, he he's past three million. Wow, wow. Shoot, I remember back in the day having three, like, you had three million subscribers, like, you was, like, the most subscribed person. I remember, like, yeah, ten years ago, when it was, like, Ray William Johnson and Smosh, and they were, like, the biggest YouTube platforms and stuff, and they were, like, the ones fighting back and forth between three million and things, like, now I'm like, that's that's actually pretty cool for Flight, that's pretty dope, so, uh, congratulations on that. I think I heard not too long ago he did hit three million subscribers, but... Anyways, or it was like a certain like milestone, but anyways, um, yeah, no, this is pretty good. I'm gonna have to probably do my own here soon since, uh, excuse me, since I'm um, being quarantined and stuff. I, yeah, because I, there's a lot, I got like a lot of different brands and different types of shoes. A lot of them are like running shoes, but then, um, yeah, a good portion of them are sneaker shoes and stuff, so. But anyways, um, yeah, this was a pretty good video, Flight. Make sure you guys go subscribe to Flight React for more videos like this. Like and subscribe to me, too. I will talk to you guys later. Thank you guys for watching, and peace.